everybody. So in um, a video before, I showed you how I use our addition chart to do some practicing with addition equations. I'm going to show you a different kind of addition chart that we have in the classroom. Some of you may have seen this one before. So let's take a look at this chart here. Do you notice anything about this chart that's different than this chart? I noticed that there's a blue um, row of numbers on this chart, but this one does not have a blue row of numbers. And all of these boxes are filled in with numbers on this chart. But on this one, there's only a few numbers. So this is a chart that you can use a little bit differently. I'm going to show you how we use it. In this one, your fingers get to hop. I'm going to show you how. So if I wanted to do two plus four, I would go two plus four. equals six. My fingers got to go across two plus four and then they hop together equals six. Okay, so let me write that down. Two plus four equals I'm going to pull one of my equation tiles out of the bag and we can practice a few more of these. Okay, nine plus six. So nine plus six, let's see what nine plus six equals. We have a nine and a six. Okay, if there's nowhere to hop, we get to go in the middle. So let me show you that again. Nine plus six equals 15. Nine plus six equals 15. You can write that here. Nine plus six equals 15. Okay, let's see another tile in here. Let's see what my next equation will be. Okay, five plus one. You know, I already know five plus one. I know it equals six. I know that one by heart. But let me show you what it looks like on the chart. So I have five plus one. So let me slide my fingers. And then we get to hop. There it is. Five plus one equals six. Five plus one equals All right, three plus six, three plus six, three plus six equals nine. Three plus six equals nine. Three plus Nine. Okay. Oh, there's another one I know by heart. Six plus one. I know that six plus one equals seven. I'm gonna put that in here. The more equations that I know by heart, um, the better that those will help me in elementary because we're going to use these same equations a lot in elementary. So we have six 
plus one. Let's see if we can slide these, and it should equal seven. Seven. Six plus one equals seven. Six plus one equals seven. Okay. Might be what I'll get this time. Ooh. Nine plus four. Find my nine. There's nine plus four. It doesn't matter which order you slide your fingers. You can slide this one first or this one. Thirteen. Nine plus four equals thirteen. Nine plus. Four equals 13. Okay, let's do a couple more. I usually like to finish a whole page when I'm doing these. Ooh, five plus five. I think I know that one. Let's see. Five plus five, guess what? We don't have to do any hopping. We're already on the same square. Five plus five equals 10. Okay, five plus five equals 10. Okay, a few more spaces left. Ooh, another, another that has the same digit twice, same add end. Seven plus seven equals, not much hopping to do here, 14. Okay, seven plus seven equals 14. One plus three. Oh, I already know that one. That one is four. Let's check. One plus three. It's four. One plus three equals four. One plus three equals four. And I have one more space. This will be my last equation for today. Six plus three. Okay, six plus three. Six plus three equals nine. Okay, I'll write it here. Six plus three equals nine. Hmm, I think I already saw this sum before. Let's see. Oh, I saw it right here. Two different sums of nine. I wonder what we had. We had three plus six equals nine, and we had six plus three equals nine. You might notice some patterns too when you do this work. All right, thank you for doing addition with me. Bye.